In my second video about the iOS 26 public beta, I want to look at the Photos app, which has been overhauled. There are a couple of things worth noting, and one of them works remarkably well. So within Apple Photos, there was always the idea that you could uh, go back to the year dot and you could expand and contract and overview and all the, the useful views of your photographs. But in iOS 18, they kind of brought in a lot of these extra ways of organising and categorising your photos. And I've com compressed a few of these for privacy reasons. But if you go back to library now, again, there are all your photos and everyone should be happy. And you can, of course, sort by years, months and just all photos, of course. Now, what's interesting is that the editing cleanup tool is an awful lot better right up with the competition now. Let's take this tree on a nice walkway in the forest, tap on clean up, again circle the uh, tree we want to remove, see how we go. Clean up and bang! The tree was never there. I think that's quite impressive. I'm going to cancel it because I do want the tree, but you get the idea. Let's take another kind of random example. How about dogs? Everybody loves dogs. Uh, here's our dashing. Let's try and take the lead off. I'll tap on clean up and I'm going to, to approach the lead in three sections because itself has got three distinct areas of colour and texture. That's, that's the second of three. And then we'll have a go at um, the third section. I think that's pretty darn good. That's, that's worth saving. I'm going to save that. Well done, Apple Photos. So yes, really quite impressive. So yes, previously I'd have gone to Google Photos to do the uh, the auto cleanup and AI stuff, but now it's kind of seems to be working with Apple Photos in iOS 26.